I'm delighted to welcome all of you to Wired Health 2025. I think the one thing to take away from today is the fact that we have so many people working across uh, so many disciplines in a really interdisciplinary way. People really coming together to think about how their different fields can impact research uh, in ways that are really going to shift the dial in terms of, of healthcare of the future. Generally in healthcare, what we're seeing is a move to digitalization. My subject is about antibiotics and antimicrobial resistance. And what I'm really thrilled about is how people are beginning to use data and AI to develop new drugs. There's a lot of great shifts in healthcare. Obviously one that I'm paying a lot of attention to is artificial intelligence. There's everything from what DeepMind is doing with AlphaFold and the kind of amplification of science within biology to what we're doing in Manus, accelerating drug discovery of key things like cancer. And this evolution of kind of what's happening with healthcare is perhaps one of the most wonderful and optimistic things about the human condition today. The most exciting shift is the world of cancer vaccines. What you're seeing is major technology spheres coming together, AI, genomics, mRNA technology. And the most amazing thing is that it's now going to benefit people with cancer. And it's actually quite amazing that the benefit of everything we've gone through from 2020 is now coming to the fore and we're going to see benefits in 2025, hopefully by the end of this year. For me, the most exciting shift is a focus on prevention. Lately, there is an appreciation that preventative medicine is very important. Catch diseases early using biomarkers of aging, but also clinical biomarkers in order to detect changes to organ function before they turn to disease. To make an impact for patients' lives, to make an impact around the quality of care that we deliver, and to make an impact across the continuous learning. Because as we know, in the OR, every single moment matters. But if we're able to really create a mechanism that allows us to connect, to collect, and to activate knowledge and insights, it truly means we can live up to why we all chose healthcare as our calling. Healthcare's big. 300 million patients every year worldwide have some form of major surgery. It is so important for us and for so many of the innovators here today and taking part in Wired Health that we innovate, that we start improving healthcare because this impacts lives on a per second basis. So I was on a panel today about using artificial intelligence from delivery to diagnosis. For me, what was really interesting about the panel was just seeing all of the different aspects where AI can have impact. Mm -hmm.